This is what we do now? Kill our own because they blew open a conspiracy in our own backyard. You don't know what this will do. I know. And I'm sorry. What is this? What is this? Kane! Kane! Hendrix! I don't think you quite appreciate or even understand what I'm telling you. What is that? Is that a baby? Hello? Is anyone there? Information is a two-way street. If you remove humans from the diagnostic loop, there is no way to predict or control or influence. We're standing on the verge of... Paul? What did you do to me? I tried to interface with your DNI. Something went wrong. Can you hear me? It can't be. Cain, can you hear me? Are you seeing this? Say something. Please. It's the Black Project. It's right before the whole place blew up. Right before 300,000 people died. This is where I was born. A brief moment of agony. Then, darkness. Who is that voice? It all started. Their experiments let a chemical agent escape into the atmosphere. Sarah? That voice, do you recognize it? I remember, but it's almost like it was a dream. Like it was happening to someone else. Tell me everything you remember. The CIA sent us in to investigate an alarm triggered underneath the old coalescence facility. We figured the immortals had been tipped off. Check the room. Clear. Fucking human test subjects. This is in breach of every WA ethics mandate in the book. That's all I fucking need. Oh, call it in. Let's go immortal hunting. We all knew that we had just stumbled onto a CIA black program that had been buried for a decade. A program that in all probability had led directly to the Singapore disaster. We called it in and we were ordered back to the Black Station for debriefing. All right, you know the routine. Secure the area, I'm gonna pull all sensitive information from their servers. Go. Taylor, 
You okay? Yeah. Getting some glitches in my optics. Okay. Let me help you recalibrate. Sarah! Can you hear me? I know what this is. This is what's I studied it at the Academy. I cited it in my final paper as one of the greatest examples of courage and bravery in military history. One of those battles that show you what you're really made of, who you really are. I used to dream about it. Follow me. I'll show you what I mean. Congratulations, Private. You drew the shortest straw of all. Welcome to Bastogne. Now get your ass to the front line. How is this possible? We're on the battlefield of World War II. This has to be an illusion. It has to be. Why are we here, Sarah? Don't you know? So much suffering, so much pain. It wasn't just the enemy soldiers. What the hell was that? The dire wolves. At first, they scavenged upon the wounded, the weak. Later, they went after the strong. Have you heard it before? You forced a DNI interface knowing that it would scramble my mind. You were dying, Sarah. I had no choice. Dying! We needed to know the truth. You have to focus. Try to remember. What happened at that black station? We'd uncovered a secret that could destabilize the geopolitical landscape and undermine the Winslow Accord forever. We should have known why we were recalled to base. We couldn't be trusted. They couldn't take the risk. When people really want to bury secrets, they tend to bury bodies right along with them. They said they needed to run a diagnostics check, but that wasn't the truth. We were marked for termination. But by the time we got there, the staff were already dead. Carved to pieces by a 54 Immortals Enforcer by the name of Zhe Zhang. We knew they'd send a wet work team after us. We had no choice but to cut a deal with the Immortals and get the hell out of Singapore. That wasn't what happened, Sarah. 
We saw the footage from the data drives. You did it. You butchered them in cold blood and made it look like a ritualistic king. You denied them their reincarnation. Just like Jejong. Why? Why do you think we're here? What's so significant about this battle? Why did you dream about it? I played the details over and over in my mind. I knew I wasn't strong enough to fight this battle. I knew I wasn't brave enough. When I wrote that paper, I hadn't even seen real combat yet. I had read first-hand accounts of what they went through, but I couldn't imagine how they did it, how they held on. Sometimes you have to hold on. Sometimes you have to let go. This is the path I must take. The path we both must The German Tiger Tank, King Tiger they called it, immune to most munitions. Are you strong enough to defeat it? that's all that's left, all you have. We killed them. We killed them all in cold blood. I remember him, but I don't... I don't feel like I remember it. Am I losing my mind? Is this hell? Sarah, I need to know where Taylor is. This is out of control. We need to stop this. You should not be here. Stay with me. After you discovered the Black Project, you went looking for Selene. 
We traded the intel from Corvus and the Black Station to the Immortals. Their CDP connections gave us passage to Egypt. Once we had Salim's location, we used an NRC assault to make the grab. What was so important about Salim? The Doctor was the only one who knew about the forest. Taylor was obsessed. We all were. He said it was the only place we'd ever be safe. Where'd you go, Sarah? Did you find somewhere safe? We held up in the old aquifers and made our plan to snatch Salim. The aquifers? The mobile water refineries in the desert? Is that where Taylor and Moretti are headed now? It must be. Kane should be able to locate the exact coordinates. Sarah, what happened when you grabbed Salim? What happened in Kebeshet? What did he tell you? We need to know. use we're out of time we got to get out of here why are you doing this to me i have done nothing wrong you were part of it you were there from the beginning the cia dni mind control program taylor we got incoming hall suit up deal with it what do you want from me tell me about the frozen forest the, the forest is, is nothing it was just an idea i planted in the minds of the patients it was meant to help them find peace after the experiments. Right, the illegal DNI experiment. Hidden beneath a corporate facade, a project that killed over 300,000 people. It wasn't my fault. Something happened with the software that collated and streamed the test subjects' experiences. The project was no longer under control. I was not to blame. Then who was? Who was? The the project was under the direct command of Sebastian Kruger, a senior executive in coalescence. After the disaster, he relocated to the headquarters in Zurich. Thank you. This is a simulation, right? Like in training. <laughs> you're, you're testing me. I know it. It's not a simulation. It's real. You heard what the doctor said. The frozen forest isn't real. It is just a way of calming down the test subjects. Controlling them! I think I know what this is. You've been chasing something that doesn't exist! I know what's happening. What the hell is that? Sarah, these monsters are trying to kill us. Second surge of chemical and electrical activity in a dying brain. Short circuiting the DNI. 
a flood of memories and thoughts, half real and half imagined. Let me go. Listen only to the sound of my voice. Let your mind relax. Imagine yourself in a frozen forest. So... Was it worth it? They're at the aquifers. Are you okay? Kane. The interface just went very, very wrong. It was like I was inside Hall's waking nightmare. But that isn't all. There was something inside her mind. Something born at Corvus before the accident. It was fighting me every step of the way. It's manipulating Taylor and the others. It made them kill the Black Station staff and they didn't even know. I think it's getting smarter. We need to talk. <laughs> 